Hello, welcome to the Maya Tool Belt. This is Michael. This is the Maya 2016 update for the Rigid Bind tutorial. And this one's a bit of a doozy. They actually removed Rigid Binding from the menu. If you were trying to follow along in that previous tutorial, it's kind of hard now because now that they have the rigging menu, which is different from the animation menu now, they've split out all the skeleton tools into its own menu set. So instead of going to the animation menu set and then going to the skeleton menu, now you'll go to the rigging menu set and go to the skeleton menu and you can create your joints and then under the skin menu you have bind skin and that's it. There's no, there's no rigid bind. Bind skin is essentially a smooth bind and they took out the rigid bind menu item completely. Uh, however you can still get to it if you want to use it. Uh, I need to go to display UI elements and I need to open up the command line. So I have my mail, mail scripting command line down here. So you'll see I have this cylinder and some joints here created in the scene already. If I select my cylinder, hold shift, and select my root joint, down here in the mail scripting area of the command line, I'll type rigid bind skin, hit enter. So you see I have a bind pose now, and when I move my root joint, it it moves the cylinder as well. However, if when I try to bend these joints around, you'll see that's not really working. So I need to undo all that stuff. Okay. So I need to open up the options for bind spin, right? So I'll select my skeleton root joint, hold shift and select my geometry. I guess it is reversed. And I can click down here in the mail scripting and type in rigid bind skin options. Hit enter. And here are my rigid bind skin options. And so I can change the bind to method to the complete skeleton instead of selected joints and so on. So with the option menu open here, I can select my geometry, hold shift, select my skeleton, root joint, say bind to complete skeleton, bind skin. So now when I rotate these, you see now I get the binding that I expect with my joints rotating the geometry kind of under the table kind of way of getting to rigid bind but it's still there it's just not within the menus anymore so sorry if that caused any confusion uh, otherwise the options are also the same they still work the same as they did in the original rigid bind tutorial which I'll create a link here for that uh, so so thanks a lot for watching and I'll talk to you later